By the way, welcome back to a Friday, special Friday episode of Banjo Kazooie. Friday. Uh, we bring you nothing. TGIF. <laughs> go to the go to a bar. Um, unless you're people like me who work on Saturdays. Have you been to a TGI Fridays? Negatory. No, I want to. I want to. Do they have TGI Fridays in Australia? There, yes, yes. There's like two, two or three from down in Melbourne. Um, and I think there's like uh, one or two in Sydney. Okay. But, you know, I've always wanted to go there. They've got like a special... I, I don't know if the Australian one has it, but they've got this uh, like Jack Daniels... Um, barbecue sauce. sauce. Barbecue yeah, sauce. That I've is heard like of this. All, like, I've, I've, I've also heard they've got really good like spicy wings. Oh, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, I, I didn't realize they had one in Australia. Um, do you do you go to TGIFs if it's not Friday? Oh, <laughs> uh, I, I guess they would. People love their cheap wings. Well, there you go. Um, but yeah, like I've watched. Well, you've seen sometimes on like trying to when you watch like wrestling live and that in the USA Network through uh, totally legal means. Um, and you see, like, the American ads, they're, some of them, like, for the wings that are amazing. And they just get you so hungry. And you're like, oh, I wish I had that. Well, one of the reasons why I want to go to America is because I'm a fat ass and I want to eat some of their foods. Oh, yeah. Um, I'll go on a binge. Go I, I reckon if I were to go to America, though, I would actually go on a diet before I go. Just because I'd want to lose a bunch of weight before I go over because I can guarantee I'm coming back heavier. Oh, I would too. I would too. Just so I could lose some weight, um, eat some food. G glorious food. Mm. Is there like a particular chain or something that you've always wanted to try? Not really. Um, I didn't. Don't actually know. Um, like, I want to try their Wendy's. I want to. Their went I've heard their Wendy's is good. Mm. Um, I want to try a bacon. In and Out Burger. In and Out. Yes. In and Oh yes. In and Out Burger. Um, I want to go to Sonic? a proper. Uh, not really. A proper Korean like proper barbecue. Like, they mm. had those barbecues. Oh, yeah. I don't know if um, it's their barbecues. Uh, New York pizza? No, uh, I wouldn't say New York. I, I'd, I'd go for more Chicago deep dish pizza. Is that the more popular one? Yeah. Well, yeah, really, really popular. Chicago deep dish pizza. Mm. I remember yeah, that. That is, that, that, that is apparently the best pie. Pie. Yeah, they call pie. They call pizza pie. Yeah, I know they do. Um, they also call it czar. Get yeah, they, 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 they call soft drink soda. Yeah, we call it soda here yeah. too, but we just call it soft drink because... Soft drink, yeah. Uh, but the biggest ones, like, they're like, oh, uh, they call it pop. Soda like, pop. Yeah, yeah, they call it pop. <laughs> but I, I thought soda pop was a particular soda. Yeah, me too. Um, I told, I asked my friend um, Mel from uh, Michigan, and she was like, oh, I was on a... I was on a... Sh um, on Power Talk where I had a webcam and that and I was I was drinking um, I think I was drinking some lift and she was like oh how's that pop going I'm like what how's that pop going how's my pop going he's doing alright yeah. thanks for asking <laughs> that's a strange question to ask you've never met him before he's doing alright you know he's, he's seen better days but you know oh. he's seen better days yeah that's oh. a it's, I don't know maybe because a lot of people call it soda pop and like I get it we call meat pies are one thing Americans don't get. Yeah, they're it's like, like what? Why would you have mince and gravy inside of a pastry? Fucking try it, mate. <laughs> it's amazing. Put some wax some sauce on it. Sometimes you don't even need the sauce if it's a good pie. If it's a good pie, you don't need sauce. Mm, cheese and bacon pie. Now I'm getting hungry. <laughs> it, now we're just talking about American foods and uh, making you hungry. No, Another yeah. thing is like American candies, and we get them. We get some of them here in Australia, like your Reese's Pieces and all yeah. that sort of stuff. Like, I love Reese's Pieces Peanut Butter Cups. Those things are the bomb fucking diggity. Absolutely. But then they've got other ones. Um, uh, Hershey's? You yeah. Tried a Hershey's bar? I've had a try to Hershey's I don't bar. really like Hershey's. No, neither did I. No, it's... I'm not, I'm, I'm not sure if it's, like, too powerful or that, but it just doesn't taste like chocolate. It was very... It's very cocoa. Like, it's got a lot of cocoa in it. Yeah, it's overpowering. Um, a lot of people like it. Um, mm. I, obviously, because we eat a lot of uh, Cadbury chocolate. Mm. Oh, Americans love Cadbury chocolate. They're like, what is this? Well, in America now, you can find Tim Tams yeah, everywhere. Uh, yeah, freaking, um, I'm not sure if they make them there over there now, but, um, you know, you can buy them from Amazon and and they can actually buy it. And no, they, like, can get them in a, they can get them in stores now. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Wow. In certain stores, they can get um, Tim Tams mm. uh, because it's very popular mm. and it was worth the import because people are buying them. Oh, yeah. Um, they started also doing that in um, in London and that too now. A lot of another lot of uh, lot of um, things 
Milo. Milo. Um, Milo's very Australian. Um, yeah, apparently South Africa gets it. Oh, I think it's a different Milo. People oh. have tried it and it tastes different. Oh, really? Yes. Because it works very similar to the way that Australians have, like, we might have a certain, a good a good example you and I both would understand is alcohol. Yeah, um, uh, yes. Like, absolutely. you'll have a certain alcohol, like, that's, like, based in America. Like, Bud, some Budweiser's for in Australia are made with Australian product. But it's made, uh, brewed, it's brewed under license of Budweiser. Yeah, just like uh, Corona is yep. the same thing. Because, um... Um, I tried genuine Corona, uh, genuine Corona. Um, the Coronitas. The Coronitas, yeah, the small, tiny ones, They'd... and it tasted tasted um, not too different, but it was you can you can tell. And um, the only reason that they uh, I got them was because the store sold them, and they're not really supposed to because we have some really strict alcohol laws when it comes towards um, you know pandering, like smaller drinks and that. I'm usually like, no, no, that's advertisement for kids. Is it? Yeah, um, that's why the tiny Corona bottles were um, banned. Sort of like, uh, you remember the Duff cans? Yep. Yep, they're banned. Oh, because it promotes drinking because of The Simpsons, and yeah. The Simpsons is a family-friendly show. Yeah, yeah, um, there's been some cases of... Because um, those Duff cans disappeared really quickly off the shelves. Yeah, um, they, they either got told to recall or they were in bargain bins. I know we had some when I worked in um, the BWS at Swan yeah. Hill. So we uh, we had it out there, and I, I bought it, and oh, it it was not worth <laughs> any amount of money to drink. That. No, it was it was fucking terrible. It beer. was the worst. It, it tasted like off Carlton Draft. Yes, <laughs> I reckon that's exactly what it tasted like. Um, I'll drink Carlton Draft as much as the next bloke, but I'm not a big fan of it. Mm. Um, it's okay. I got used to it. I used to drink it all the time after work. I would always get that free knockoff, and I'll be like, oh, d- draft dry. I've got some mid strength, maybe Guinness. I'm like, oh, no. I don't know how people can drink Guinness. Guinness is something I could never drink. It's it's a very quiet taste. Oh, uh, yeah, as in, like, you must take, you must like the taste of shit <laughs> to acquire the taste. Because yeah. I've tried it. I've tried the extra stout, I've tried the Guinness draft, so the one that's from Ireland. Yeah. Like the one that's actually imported. And all of it tastes exactly the fucking same to me. I, I used to drink it all the time because my boss, when I worked in the commercial, uh, was Irish. So I actually worked for Irishman in a bar, and that was, uh, you know, <laughs> I could... I was going to say, if there's one bunch of people that can outdrink Aussies, it's the Irish. Oh, yes. Uh, I, I learned that the hard way. But, you know, they also have a limit themselves. Oh, yeah. It's uh, mostly hard liquor. I've drank with an Irishman myself, and he kicked the living fuck out of me. Not f- literally, like, he beat me so hard at drinking, and I'm good at drinking. Um, actually, I probably shouldn't say that so much these days. Back when I was younger, I definitely was. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, these days, I've definitely slowed down, but even back when I was drinking with him, he... I was still doing okay at the time, so... Well, you know they are allowed to drink from... Um... Oh, there's a jiggy right under that bridge. Yeah, I saw... No, it wasn't a jiggy. It was a... What is it? One of those... Um... Creatures. Yeah, sure. I can't remember what their names are. Jimbo... J- Jinjos or something like that, I think. Yeah, Jinjo. 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 Okay, uh, uh, that, uh, that was a little too racist. <laughs> a what? <laughs> that was a bit too racist. I didn't hear it, so... Oh, a Jinjo. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's not like I said um, the word that I shouldn't be saying. Yeah, I was going to say, not like you should say what word. <laughs> None of those words should be said ever. It's been a while since I've had to censor anything, so... Well, I've, I, I, the last be few refreshing. times I've said stuff, you know, Gary was the one that said it, and I was like, what? For once, it wasn't me. Yeah. I, that's actually the last time I censored something was that. Yeah. <laughs> How many do I have? I do have enough to get through. 180. Oh, so... Yay! Yup, all right, where are we at now? I can't remember. Wow, this witch really loves the side of her own face. Yeah, every, what, every... what is it? Um, what, what's the word I'm thinking of? Ostentatious? No. What's the word I'm thinking of? Uh, I'm usually good with this, but you got me at a loss as well. I remember this level. This level is the bad level. This one's got all like the gunky stuff for it. Hello. Uh, it's it's the fairy, fairy godmother. God troll. <laughs> Grentilda, Grentilda's nicer sister. I'm just living in this sewer because, yeah, right? <laughs> so they're all witches, but she's the good witch, and this one, and Gruntilda's the bad witch. So, as they will help you avoid a fiery fate, press X if you like to hear them. My <laughs> fat old sister's favorite sport is broomstick racing. 
Come and fight me. Hello. <laughs> Fucking get out of the way, Come you at me, bro. thick fuck. Okay. This is something. Yeah, there, there they are. It's a shoot. Hey, keep your feet out. You can't use us until you've spoken to bottles. Bo bottles. Uh, so bottles is the. You know. We just need a whack. Whack them all. <laughs> all right. So I'm gonna get this next level open, and that'll be the end of this episode. Mm -hmm. Until next week. Next week. Oof. This, I think the next level's up here. I'm pretty sure. Bravo! Yep. Nope, oh. that's... Oh, it's too sexy. Alright, well, thanks for... I think I can save it. I don't know if I can. Oh. Either way, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Yep, and uh, tell us about your favourite alcohol and how you would actually prepare it. Yeah. Yeah. I, I like a good G&T sometimes, gin and tonic. As long as it's good gin and it's good tonic water. I'm a, I, I love a nice whiskey. Eh, I've sort of gotten away from whiskeys. Yeah. Alright, bye. Bye. Pretty sure that was safe. I'm not sure, but we'll find out. Next time on Dag.